Hi, this is Lee McBain with TheBeerBoard.com and I am here today to do a, a box opening of the new Brew Demon Fermenter system. This is actually the Signature Series uh, brew system uh, that we're going to be opening and I wanted to show you what the box looked like and also what's on the inside. So when you buy one of these or when you get one of these, and we'll talk about that a little bit later, you'll know exactly what's going to be in the box. So here we go. We're going to open this boy up. Go ahead and turn this around a little bit. First thing we have is the instructions, as you can see right here. We'll set that right here. And then we have very well packed the cardboard holds the fermenter right in place and it looks like we've got uh, some bottles set these over here so you get eight of these bottles one liter bottles or quart bottles we get a spoon well, there it is. Nice spoon to be able to stir your wort with. We get the hose and the bottling so we've got a, a top and the top has a, a insert in it which seals the, the uh, fermenter and I'm going to have to pull everything out of the fermenter first. We've got the bottle caps for the bottles. And here's some more bottles that are actually stuffed inside of the fermenter uh, for packaging reasons. So there we go. And then we've got this right here is the hardware for the fermenter. These are the legs and the, um, the cap the legs with the caps, the spigot, the one step, and then the other stuff that you need for the fermenter. And then here it is. Here is the fermenter. That's it right there and I'm going to come a little bit closer so you can get a better look at it. But right here is the fermenter. It stands, in once it's in the stand with the lid on, it stands about 16 inches wide or tall and is just over nine inches wide uh, so it's very comparable to uh, other two gallon fermenters that you might have seen um, this does hold a full two and a half gallons of, of wort um, and still gives you plenty of headroom uh, fermenter for the um, Kreisen, Kreisen and um, being able to let the yeast do its trick. So we'll set that there. <clears throat> We've got labels. So there's your eight labels for your bottles. We've got a instructions for using and uh, sanitizing your bottling wand and hose. And then in the bottom here we have two cans of the Brew Demon One Evil Pilsner Signature Series uh, recipe and then this is the rest of the stand. So there you go. Everything that you see here is everything you need to start a full uh, batch of beer. Um, it makes it really simple, really easy. Um, you put the stand together which is very simple then the fermenter fits right in this stand um, one of the nice things I do like about this fermenter is that there isn't a lot of ridges or edges that can catch bacteria in it uh, so it works out really nice now if you see right here over my shoulder uh, this is my current batch I've actually got the one evil pilsner cooking in there right now uh, about another week uh, another few days, another week, I'll be able to bottle that and, uh, and start uh, waiting for that to condition in the bottle. Right here, 
I have the um, Wild Spirit IPA, and I brewed that a, a couple of weeks ago. So right now it's conditioning. The bottles are nice and hard, uh, so we'll be able to see how that turns out in another week or so. Um, one of the really nice things that I've seen about the, uh, that I like about the fermenter is that all the, all the churb collects at the bottom in this little cone and really keeps it away from the, um, from the spigot. You don't have to worry about that. I actually measured that it takes about 18 ounces of fluid uh, before it even approaches the bottom of the spigot opening on the inside. So you don't even have to worry that your trub is going to get anything close. In a two and a half, two gallon, two and a half gallon uh, recipe, uh, you'll never have to worry about that, um, the trub getting that high. Uh, now, even if you brew a big batch, you know, maybe a, a special recipe that you put together yourself, all grain, maybe something like that, um, you're not going to have to worry about that. But that's everything I've got. This is the Brew Demon Signature Series Brew Kit. Everything you see here also includes the stick-on thermometer that comes that is attached to it. Uh, makes it really simple and easy to read. All this can be yours. Now I realize that a lot of people have been interested in this and Brew Demon has been really kind to us here at the Beer Borg and we are going to be giving this kit, this exact kit, I'm going to pack it all back up, put it in the box, put it back in the box that it was sent to me with and I'm going to send it to one of you. All you have to do is be a member of the Beer Borg Social Go there, sign up, and there's instructions on the website. This is starting on January 27th. Yep, that's Sunday. Sunday, January 27th. We will be starting the giveaway for this Brew Demon kit. It will run through February, 20, uh, February 14th. That's Valentine's Day. And uh, on the 16th of February, we will be announcing the winner. So deadline for this is February 14th, 2013. And you will get everything that you saw here, including the recipe, the bottles, and the fermenter, the conical fermenter, the one and only two-gallon conical fermenter available. So if you're interested, if you want this for your own, then go to thebeerboard.com. Become a member of this Beer Bork Social and start the conversation there. And if you have any questions, my screen name is Louis Mac Goo on the forum. And uh, you can ask me and I'll be more than happy to help you out. Hey, thanks for joining me today. If, you have any, uh, if you're interested at all, we have lots of great articles up there on the website. Um, we're always looking to improve the website. So please come on by beerborg.com and uh, we hope to see you there. Until then, keep on brewing and have a great day.